30,000 pounds of belongings. That what, that's what some local leaders say will likely be all over downtown San Diego unless the community helps a transitional storage center stay open. NBC7's Candace Wynn has more on the issue and how it may impact you. Candace. Well, Monica, I brought out these six trash bags to show you how much fits in just one bin. And with more than 300 bins right over this gate here, that would be a lot of stuff in our streets. But more than that, those who come here say it gives them an opportunity to leave their things and go find work. That same person that walked into on the, on the storage center with his bags and all this warm stuff on, come out with a suit and tie. It's amazing. It's a big transition. And it looks better. When they walk down the street, you wouldn't even know they were homeless anymore. Danny McRae was homeless. He now runs a storage center on 16th and Commercial Street and says countless people have found work because they were able to leave their belongings here. The center is in jeopardy of closing on January 10th, less than a month from now, because organizers have not been able to find enough funding or a permanent location. Now they're asking for the public's help. It's 4,300 square feet, which seems... Oh, there's so, so much space downtown, and it seems like, oh, that's so feasible. There's easily that much space. But we've hit a lot of roadblocks. To donate, or if you have a location suggestion, you can go to girlsthinktank.org, or, of course, you can go to our website, NBCSanDiego.com. Reporting live from the East Village, I'm Candace Wynn, NBC7.